everybody today we're back again uh, today we're going to be speaking about learning something that is very important in well this world because learning is acknowledging something or just basically a permanent change in somebody's knowledge or your behavior due to something called experience and it's the process of acknowledging anything basically but what are you going to do if your brain cannot contain information like you can't learn you don't want to you're you're just like oh, man i can't contain this information and i got a test tomorrow you have to be physically rested and mentally rested because so you can like at least use enough capacity of your brain so you can understand something or even learn it. So how do I learn something? Your brain. Well, <laughs> with your brain. Well, your brain is something that's very fragile because we all know the same thing and we all probably, you think that everybody knows something, but it turns out that they don't know it. Be why? Because your brain well, because they all look alike and they all look the same, but aren't really all the same. You have to want something and your brain has to want or love getting that information or consuming it because it has to be a specific type of information and acknowledging it. But you basically, you're just accepting with your brain the information in front of, or behind or anywhere. So your brain could actually get the information and consume it. You let it get in, basically. There are the best sufficient ways to learn anything properly. Number one is you need to take notes, like to, to learn languages, well, and keep them aside when you need it. Have effective notes, note talking skills. You have to have effective note-talking skills. You always have to be ready. You always have to know what you're doing. You have to be prepared. You don't prepare for your day, but you gotta be prepared because your day is nothing like what you can imagine. The end of the world might be right now. <gasps> like if I really died there, you wouldn't have ever known. Well, duh, of course you wouldn't know. And second thing is you need to distribute your practice, study, sleep, and more reading. It's more important. Reading is the most, most important thing in this world because reading is acknowledging and getting information. We'll get into that a little bit later on. It is more important. Reading is more important, of course. Use brain breaks to restore focus. And this helps me, honestly, a couple of times. So, uh, yeah, that's a really good one. This helps you a lot. So, these are just the basics on how you could learn. But why is learning very important? Learning is very important because what you learn is something that just doesn't come out of nowhere. It enriches the brain and it feeds it, just like the nutrition for the body, except now, these are nutrition for the brain. Your brain is eating every time you learn something new. Learning new things gives us a feeling of accomplishment. That actually gives you something that you feel like you did. Like, when you learn English, you're like, oh man, it's great. When you learn Spanish, you're like, Yes, I know something better. Yeah. And you got that deep heart burning inside of you being like, all right, man, let's get to learning. <laughs> so it gives us a feeling of accomplishment that boosts our confidence in our own capabilities. You'll also be more ready to take on life's great peak of challenges and explore new adventures and businesses. Gaining new skills and even more, like solving world problems. Learning is the most important thing because learning allows us to gain and convert information, which is the most powerful power in the world. Informing people is the best thing and learning leads to businesses and businesses and entrepreneuring. Entrepreneuring. Yeah, that's a word. I English. <laughs> 
is the only thing that can get you away from the green to the green. Well, basically, as in from trash to cash money. So uh, that was part one of this podcast. Part two will be soon. Uh, yeah, just share this with your friends. And remember, this podcast was brought to you by Muhammad Talks. Bye! See you next time, guys! <laughs>